Good day all. Welcome back to the channel. Today, let's see how we can manage customers and track the payment dues in order 15 point of sale. So here, when you open point of sale, you can create and uh, manage all the customers from here. Like under orders, you can view all the created customers. You can find few details shown on the Kanban view and this view. So here, if you open the customer form, you can see that uh, the name of the customer and whether this customer is an individual or a company. And if we can find the address of the customer, contact address, then phone number, email, then website, tax assigned to the customer. Uh, then you can see the contacts and addresses linked to the customer and some default sales and purchase later details set on the customer. Like you can see, uh, we have set a default price list for the customer, public price list USD. So this can be used in order to compute the price of uh, products. And you can find the payment terms set for this customer. And here we can also separately uh, view the point of sale details. So here we can see a unique barcode set for the contact, uh, which is used to identify this contact and loyalty points set for the customer, which is assigned based on the loyalty program. So this can be used to uh, give rewards to the customers in the form of discounts of free products and set fiscal position, uh, inventory location and accounting details, internal notes, and you can also track the total um, scheduled meetings and opportunities created out of customer and the total sales and purchases, on-time rate, then the total amount due, the total amount uh, invoiced, vendor bills. Then we have a partner ledger report and we can also track the total point of sale orders. So for this customer ledger in detail, you can see here, uh, uh, some orders are posted, some orders are paid, and some are in new stage. So like this way, you can create and manage customers. So you can click on this create button to create new customer. And now let's come back to a point of sale dashboard where you can find our uh, shops and bars. So here we already have opened a shop. Now if I have to open the settings, you can see the enable features and here under interface you can see a new option added in order 15 which is used to limit the partners loading so it will only load a limited number of customers at the opening of the point of sale and you can set the number of partners loaded or you can load or and you can also load all remaining partners in the background so i'm not right now i'm not enabling this so we'll discuss about this feature in a different video uh, now let's continue selling. Uh, so here we can see all the products in different categories. And here from this uh, keypad, you can find option to choose your customer. So here we can find uh, all the customers created. And you can see details like name of the customer, address, phone number, email, then the total loyalty points appeared. And also along with this, you can find the total amount due. So here for the customer, uh, Azure India, you can see the amount due is 33,897.50. And here when you click on this customer, you also have an option uh, to click on this card and settle the payment by choosing a payment method so you can set the due so you can click on validate you can see the total amount and you can see from customer account uh, this much amount is deducted Now, if we check the orders, you can see uh, the total amount paid through uh, cash payment method. Uh, 
and if you select a customer uh, you also have an option to edit uh, details so when you click on this edit you can find option to change the street city passcode state and all other details related to the customer so you can after editing you can save or you can discard it and here we can also find option to search the customer so you can search for his name you can find the customer and you can also click on this external link so here he will be directed to the uh, customer form now let me just set this customer you can see the customer is set here and here we can add products to the order line so you can see the total loyalty points uh, given and we can add customer note and set to the payment choose a payment method here we can see for the customer receipt is created by adding the product and amount details Then we can also generate invoice for your customer. So after adding products order line, after uh, choosing the payment method, here we can find option to generate invoice for this customer. So when you click on validate, that is after validating the payment, you can see invoice generated. And you can send this invoice and also receipt as email to the customer and now in order 15 you can also link your quotations or orders to point of sale so you can link your old quotations or orders created uh, so let me choose a customer so if i choose colon this and after that if you click on this quotation order you can find all the related quotations of this customer so right now we don't have any uh, related quotations for that customer so if you close that filter you can find all the uh, other quotations or orders uh, choose a different customer so here for this azure interview you can see a quotation is there you can click on that and settle the payment or you can apply a down payment so if you want to know how a down payment is created in order 15 point of sale you can check the link above we have done a video on that so click on settle payment directly the payment can be settled and we can also give discounts and rewards to our loyal customers so we will discuss that in detail in a different video so now that's all for this video and thanks for watching. And if you are looking for any order implementation or customization in your point of sale or any other modules, then drop a request to odoatsidebrosis.com.